Hey you guys, thank you so much for tuning into my channel today. I am going to be sharing with you my updated winter skincare routine. And I know you're sitting there like, girl, you look like it's midsummer, you I got your head wrapped, and you are, you know, just looking bright. But I did uh I like to wear colorful clothes in the winter because it just adds like I don't know, it just makes me feel happy. So um Today we're getting into my updated skincare routine because I really wanted to share this with you guys. Winter months are very, very important uh, times for you to take good, 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 good care of your skin because this is when your skin can get dry, it can get crepey, it can get just unattractive and you definitely want to have good skin, especially during cuffing season where you want to be booed up, snuggled up, you don't want to be feeling rough and dry and ashy. So I hope this is a helpful video. I hope you guys really enjoy it. If you do, make sure to... So, let's get into what I use on my face. Now, a lot of the times, um, I do enjoy wearing makeup. I especially enjoy wearing makeup when I'm filming these videos for you lovely ladies and gents. And, um... The first thing I want to do is make sure I take off my makeup properly. So I do use my makeup eraser and I have been using the makeup eraser now for almost a year. I'm a rep, a lot of you guys know that, but I really, really, really do enjoy this product because it really does remove your makeup with just water. And the less chemicals, the less foreign things I can put on my face, the better. So I really enjoy this. It really is soft. It does add a lot of exfoliation. Um, to your skincare routine and then also it just takes off 100% of your makeup. So even if you don't use wear makeup, you still have the option of the light exfoliation and just wiping off the day um, period. So that's my first skincare product that I really enjoy using and if you guys don't have it, definitely head over to my site and get you one. You can get the small one if you just want to try it out um, and see if it works for you and you enjoy it as well. So the makeup product um this is a new product i just got it last friday um this is the luna play uh they do have a larger one that is rechargeable that one is called the luna it's um from foyo foyo Foy I think it's called Foyo. um i do follow them on instagram and that's what intrigued me about um the actual device i saw it on just See, saw it in magazines and different places like that. I've also seen a lot of YouTubers review it like Nature B and uh, different people like that. So I definitely wanted to pick it up and give it a try. I was able to pick this up for $40 and it did also come with a um, foam cleanser and yeah I got it from Sephora. So this is something new that I'm adding. As far as trying it out I have showered with it one day and I really really did like um, how it made my skin feel and it's also really good because it um, is made out of nylon bristles so it doesn't harbor bacteria the same way other products can. So I'm definitely hoping that I get great results with this and I enjoy it because this would be perfect to add to my skincare routine and then also if I really do enjoy it I'm um, getting the bigger one. So yeah, this is the Luna Play and it is by for you. I'll put this in. item I'm also going to be adding to my skincare routine is by Julep and this one is a sponge um, made with green tea. Uh, this is really um, like an exfoliating one. I'm going to use this more on my like decollete area, my uh, shoulders and like the top of my back and things like that. I think this will give me a really nice feel. I do have the charcoal body one and so I did want to um, include this in my skincare routine as well. Uh, just because I want to make sure I take good care of this area and not harshly um, exfoliate it but also give it an exfoliation so I can get new healthy fresh skin growing. Alright the next product that um, I've been using is actually the Bare Face Cleansing Oil. This one is by Julep. I'm almost out. I'm about I probably have a fourth left of the container but i really 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 love this stuff i use this mostly every day um 
and I also use it in conjunction with my Dr. Bronner soap. I did tell you guys about this in a vlog. I really, really love using this. Um, I don't use it every day. I probably use it about three times a week just to get a more um, deep clean on my face and back and neck and stuff like that. I really, really enjoy this smell and it really just wakes you up. So this is something I would use in the mornings versus like before it's time to go to bed um this is a peppermint but there's lots of different scents and different um healing properties or different cleansing properties there's um the almond one there's the original which doesn't have a scent uh, there's a lot of different kinds so definitely check out dr bronner's and if you're like what does it look like this is what the um castor soap by dr bronner's looks like and you can get this at whole foods trader joe's um online you can get it a lot of different places i think even like Publix and kroger sells it so definitely um check this out if you have not this is like i'm always use this so yeah and i just put them in these travel bottles because i've been traveling and then also because i use this for more than just um like skincare i keep the big bottle like um in a in a cabinet and then i just split these up into little bottles for different purposes so yeah this one is the one for my face <laughs> okay uh, the next product I use, I've been using for a while, it is the Elixir Oil, it's by Julep as well. And if you guys see a theme, I am trying to stick to um, pretty much one product line. And I've been using Julep products now for a while, so I just wanted to stick with one product line to make sure that the properties are like about helping each other out versus using a bunch of different products, if that makes sense. So this is... Um, the elixir oil pretty much is just uh, organic Moroccan argan oil. I really, really like using this um, because it it just, to me, is like wonderful. I love to use it. I've seen it, um, I remember with my baby, she had like a, like a issue on her skin. And we used this for about a week and it went away. So I really, really like using this. And I just use this and pat it into my skin and it gives it a really nice glow. And I feel like it helps with a lot of different issues. So I've been using this. I'm probably going to keep using this. Alright, the next product is actually new. And this is the What Your Skin Needs Restorative Facial Milk. And um, I really like using this. Um, so far, I've only been using it for about um, maybe two weeks or so. This is what it looks like. This is what the um the distributor looks like and everything and then this is what the product is like some kind of like a milk and then you just rub it in I kind of pat it in like four sections or so and then just rub it into my face it, it doesn't feel greasy it really gives you like a nice healthy like sheen and I feel like it's doing a lot of really great things for my skin and I'll keep you guys updated on you know what it does and stuff like that for me product is also by Julep. This is called Night Shift. This is a sleeping mask with the power of cell complex. And this one, um, I really like the results I've been seeing with it. Uh, I've only used it twice. I, I'll list the blog where I tell you guys about it for the first time. I really enjoy this uh, so far and I think that I'm going to continue to use this and it will definitely be a part of my uh, November new skin uh, regiment so I hope you guys check it out and continue to check back on the, um, on the blog to make sure to find out what I think about it um, by the end of December. Winter time your lips can be the most crusty place on earth. So I have been using um, this is the tinted lip oil treatment. This is also by Julep and it's just like a it's really nice. It feels amazing on the lips. It feels just amazing on my skin. Uh, this one is the one that I uh, actually came broken. So I do have another one. But I mean the product still works. I just can't. I just have to like dip it onto my skin. And I also have another one that I throw in my purse. So it just feels really nice. It has a slight red tint to it. And it feels amazing. It smells kind of like a fruity nutty smell if that makes sense 
and I really really like using this as well on my lips especially now that it's getting colder and it can be windy and different things like that this feels really good on my lips all right so face let's talk about the skin so as far as my skin goes this is pretty much what I am using right now this is the rethink your shower hydrating body cleansing oil this one is also by julep I'm definitely almost done I will be repurchasing this because I really really enjoy it I really like what it does for my skin it just feels amazing I like the pump that it has on there and it really makes me feel clean um, I do not use this in my feminine area uh, I do use dr. Bronner soap for like my lady parts and I hope you guys know what I'm talking about but everywhere else for the most part I do use this I tend not to put it on my like the soles of my feet especially in the shower uh, just because you don't want to fall and bust your ass in the shower but I also use the Dr. Brenner soap on like on my feet just because I like how it makes my feet feel but for the rest of my body I do use this I really do enjoy this and this makes me feel hydrated and I find that I put on a way less lotion well I don't use lotion I use um, coconut oil so I find that I put on way less coconut oil because this has a really nice hydrating property I do also use this is the beach tonic dry body oil and this one is by julep as well and I really 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 love this um, it has a rosemary smell to it and so it goes really well if you are gonna pair like a perfume or you can just wear this alone and it gives you a nice fresh clean scent um, I like dry oils because they make you just look amazing like look at that you have like a nice healthy sheen and it just looks beautiful so yeah this is I love this stuff so yeah um, as far as my skincare routine, any of these items um, you can substitute, but I would say just stick with one brand so that you're not confusing your skin. You're not, um, yeah, you're not confusing your skin basically. So uh, as far as anything that you can supplement in my skincare routine right now, I would say I do use the. Um, this is just some coconut oil I bought at CVS. And I really like using this, especially for travel. The bottle is it's not um, glass, but it is durable. And I just like using this, especially for travel, because it's like all purpose. So if you guys, you know, forget one of your skin oils, I would say definitely head to your nearest Walgreens, CVS, or whatever, and you can find this um, there. And I don't think it was too expensive. Maybe like I don't I don't think it was very expensive at all. So I hope this video was super duper helpful for you. Um, I hope that you got some great tips. If you did, definitely thumbs up this video, watch it again, go to different parts and find out, you know, what I'm using where. Uh, if you have any questions, definitely leave them in the comments. I will be more than happy to answer them for you. And I will see you lovelies in the next one. Bye.